You always like talking about your business as soon as I go on live. Ain't nobody in there. That don't mean nothing. They can go back and hear you talking about people. Oh, no, she didn't. My ankle hurt. You want me to walk down the stairs? Yeah, I do. Oh, please no. Do you know how many times I had to go to work, even when I didn't feel like it, when you look here? Mom. Do you know how many times? A lot. Mom. Tell that little four like I ain't telling the little four like I am no more nothing. Go get mommy some water. Girl, go get me some water. I'm going to train you to go get a bottle of water. Bond said, and when the day you do that. Come on. Como estás, everyone? Como estás? Situation. Oh, you're always. That this shit. Walmart's probably the best place. What are you talking about? Because I think my shoes are just causing feet to be hurt, and I just need to be standing for eight hours straight. Or a little thought of me to break. Child, I don't know. Come on, it's nice, Nistas. Hey, miss you. Excuse me. I look like I just have. I know I look like a stove. Like I really know this. Okay. However, I am not Walmart, Target. Yeah, you eat like Nistas. Thank you. Yeah, but ain't got no um, no um, no souls. What's up, face you? How you doing, honey? Ooh, child, I just need to just hit this forehead just a little bit, honey. The last question, then I'll go get your water. You ordered the stuff? Uh-huh. Jada, you are not going to harass me about my packages. I don't care. Hey, y'all. Y'all miss me. Stacey, you studying. You doing hard work. Excuse me? Yes, you can too. <sighs> Hanging on like a hubcap in the fast lane. Girl, hang on. I'm pretty sure it's just a little bit more to go, right? Just a little bit more to go. Who else in here ain't speaking? How y'all doing? Welcome. Denisa is back, honey. Denisa is back. What? Girl. Girl, girl, girl. Using my prayers. It's almost over. Almost. You have been diligent, honey. Diligent. Girl, I'm I'm on your prayer team, okay? I'm I'm part of the prayer tribe. I ain't going to story. I am. Welcome, everyone, coming into the room. Welcome, welcome, welcome. Hit the like button, just like ringing the doorbell, okay? Hit the like button. Hey, Patricia, how are you? Vaughn, you're over there. That's right, chill. Ooh, y'all. I got some good news to share with y'all at the end of the live, at the end of the live, okay? I have some wonderful, wonderful news. Okay, well, I'm going to wait to get to the 10-minute mark, and then I'm going to start promptly because, honey, I am um, binge-watching Sisters, and honey, I'm going to just go and tell y'all, honey, it's hard out here for y'all single ladies, honey. It's hard. 
It is hard, honey. I see it. That show has opened my eyes, okay? Literally. So I hope everybody had a great work week. I did. With some gripes along the way. I did. I had some gripes out here in these, these streets. Thirsting ain't the same no more. Got me a little aggravated out here. Okay. Okay. Okay, who all who what 13 people are all in here? Is 13 people in here? Say thank you, Face. You, you was reading my mind. Who y'all is? Papo. We need to know. Okay, ain't nobody saying nothing but face you and Patricia. Okay. I know you here, honey. Did you hit the like button and walk in? Did you hit the like button? Cause I did. I'm gonna show y'all my outfit in the um my outfit for the day. I'm gonna show y'all in just a few minutes. However, um, this was a whole layering effect. And I'm going to tell you how it all started. Because I might have to try on some of these pieces tonight for y'all. So y'all can like, like have the vision. You can see it. So what best goes well with everything? Camouflage. Okay. Camo. Hey, the Fox 62. How are you? Hello, Edwina. She says she watching on her TV. Okay, honey. Watch on your TV and have your phone in your hand so you can be on there commenting with us too, okay? Hello, Stephanie. How are you? I'm going to show y'all my outfit. And the base today is camo, okay? Camo. I love that. Abundantly great. I love it. I love it. No complaints over here, honey. Every morning when I wake up, I tell the Lord, thank you very much for whispering to tell me to get up. Okay. I'm glad to know you are well too, Steph. You go by Steph or Stevie. Okay. Because um, I kind of like that for a, a nickname for Stephanie. Stevie. But I'm so used to Steph. I don't think I would respond to anybody calling me anything else. Okay. I keep moving like a rolling stone. God damn it, I'ma sing my song. All right, so I'm gonna show y'all my outfit. And like I said, it all started with the camo. That's what it started with, okay? That's the base. So we have on a camo slip dress. And this slip dress is from... Zara, I purchased this a couple years ago, okay? When slip dresses was all the rage, okay? Slip dress, as you can see, I have on this patchwork quilted coat, okay? Um, it's lined in black, and I'm definitely doing a mix on prints tonight, okay? Mix on prints. Got the pockets. This is the whole look from the back. I have on the Doc Martens, okay, combat boots. I do not want to see the top of my socks, okay? I don't. I don't want to. These are the Doc Martin Jadens. These are the Doc Martens. You ain't got to fight to get in because of the simple fact right here. It got a zipper, okay? It's got a whole zipper. <clears throat> I have on a necklace that my lipstick is popping, okay? My onk, 
I have on the old school bamboo leopard print rhinestone earrings. Okay. I did thrifties as well. This whole out this whole outfit. Let me see. Doc Martens is new. Zara um slip dress is new. Um this I purchased off of a vintage reseller on Instagram. Okay. Nothing that I'm wearing is for sale. Okay. Nothing. Okay. Because y'all know you're going to ask. Hey, Kim. How you doing? She said, wait, I got a funny. I told my husband I didn't know what was giving me heartburn. He said, it's your shopping habit. <laughs> Girl, that's what James is saying to me too, child. He be like, girl, this is that shopping habit. Yesterday, I'm going to tell y'all. Yesterday was the first time I went thrifting. And when I tell y'all, I was not happy, period. Not happy at all. Okay? Not happy. Not even a little bit. All right. I have some giveaways tonight. So let me just go ahead and put that out here first. I got two. And they both are cash value. Therefore, um, if you're purchasing tonight, you get a cash dollar amount taken off of your total. Okay. And hello and hello some map. So these are um, cash uh, giveaways tonight. So I'm going to go through the rules so everybody knows what's going on. For those of you who are new to the um, Eclect Me squad, let's go. How to make a purchase tonight. Um, everything is fall, winter essentials. And everything that I'm going to show y'all tonight can be layered and worn with other things to make other outfits. And it can just be a mix on everything, okay? Tonight I'm wearing camo just so I can show y'all how the mix can work, okay? Because I told y'all, camo is a what? Let's see who gets this cancel right. Camo is a what? So, if you see something tonight that you like, all you got to do is uh, type the word sold with the item number. Um, once you type... Thank you, Kim. She is in class. She is paying attention. Thank you, boo. She got it right. Um, you see something you want tonight, you will comment with soul and the item number. I don't recognize anything else unless I say to give a description or something, okay? Um, I'll announce who the winner is. If there is more than one person, I will announce it in the order that I see it. Um, there will be a winner, a runner-up, be a second runner-up, blah, blah, blah. Okay? If you're making multiple purchases, just wait to the end of the live. I will send out invoices letting you know what your total is, and that will include your shipping, okay? Um, acceptable payment methods that I take are Cash App, Z Cash App, Venmo, Zelle, and PayPal. If you are using PayPal, please go ahead when you get the total, go ahead and add a three dollar um, surcharge because they charge me. Therefore, it's got the ball back. Okay. Um, all payments are due the next business day, which is tomorrow, Friday, November tenth. By 12 p.m. noon, okay? Hey, Tina. Um, Eastern Standard Time, okay? If your payment is not received by that time or within that time frame, the item now becomes available to its runner-up. So if there was a runner-up for your item, it will be gone at 12.15, okay? There's no leeways, there's no holes or any anything like that. $10 for the first item that ships and a dollar for each additional item. All right. For shipping information, I will need to make sure that I have your full government name and your full mailing address. If you shop with me, I have your information already. However, if you have moved or relocated, I'm going to need you to make sure I know that updated information. Okay. Okay, y'all. Um, You can DM me 
on Instagram at I am Eclectnista, or you can email me at eclectnistashop at gmail.com. And if you see something afterwards or if you're inquiring about purchasing something, that's how you can hit me up. Um, items do get shipped out on Mondays. All right. On Mondays. Hi, Mary. Girl, you missed my Halloween outfit. It was on Instagram, honey. It was on the gram. Um, items are shipped out on Mondays. Please allow five to seven business days because I am a one-woman show, okay? And, honey, I make sure I send you your tracking information and also a picture of your package so you know what to be expecting, okay? Once the item is out of my possession, meaning it's at the post office or it's in the hands of the UPS man, Stephanie Long is no longer responsible for the package. So I'm not responsible for any lost or stolen packages, okay? And also remember, a lot of things that I show you, some will be new with still with tags. Some are vintage where the tag label may have been um, cut out by whomever it was it belonged to before. But everything is handpicked by me, okay? And so anything that you see, honey, this is stuff that stuff would wear, okay? It's been in my closet at some point, or it might be new on this rack, and it can end up in my closet eventually, okay? Okay. So if y'all ready to get started, let's go ahead and send some purple hearts or some type of emoji, child, and I will get this party on, on the road, honey. Yes, I had um, I had my whole outfit on, honey. James was a blank man, and I was blank man girlfriend, honey. I sure was. Oh, my, 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 my. My, 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 Y'all, I can listen to Erica Badu all freaking day long, okay? And be productive while listening to her, my ad, okay? All right, Kim, I see Kim, Tina, and Patricia face you. Let me get a little, a little swig, swig. Y'all, it's Veterans Day, honey. Veterans Day is being observed tomorrow, honey. Ooh, and I'm going to be out with Mr. Long, honey, going to um get some lunch, some lunch, some breakfast. Because, <laughs> honey, they do the vets right, honey, okay? Hold on, hold on. Did, did, I just did see the thing come off. Oh, okay. So, first thing I'm going to show y'all, I'm going to start with these accessories that I have right here at my fingertips, okay? Hi, Keisha Lachey. How are you? Okay, so, ooh, that light, is, it bothers me, y'all, so I can't do it like that. She said, I was red, riding hood, and I had a Halloween party. On. Okay, honey, now that's the way to do it, Okay. Hey, Love Jones One. I love camo too, honey. It's a neutral and I love it too, okay? She said, I have an ultrasound. I have fibroids. Girl, that is the devil in my house, child. The word fibroid is the devil in my house, okay? Because fibroids get on my damn nerves. Y'all already know that, child. It's the devil. How many did they say you had? Can't stand them things. Okay, so first up, I'm going to show you guys beautiful scarf. Three. Oh, my goodness. Okay, Keisha, we'll talk about your fibroids when we have a little intermission break, okay? Because I got, I got some news to tell y'all, too. Okay, so first up, we have this beautiful scarf, okay? It is black, embroidered in black, gold. It is a tiger print, okay? Tiger print. Full scarf, so you can get a full triangle out of this and wear it all kinds of ways, all right? This is item number 
in five and this is going to be fifteen dollars in five in five fifteen dollars our special yes okay so next up I have this nice little clutch it is like a snake print like uh leather it's kind of textured as well has a little flap it also has a chain as a cross body as well so it can be it can be worn like this as well or it can be a hand clutch where it stays in the hand i mean within your hand this bag right here is going to be in two in two and this is going to be 23 dollars into 23 dollars okay Bam. Okay, the next bag. This is a grandma's pocketbook. Okay, this is genuine leather. It's been nicely preserved, might I add. Okay, it has the handle top, handle top. Okay, top handle. It's in a nice cherry red. All right, it has the feet on the bottom, twist, open clasp, okay? This is it on the inside, it's deep. This is the catch. It has two other compartments that open as well. So this is one compartment, and this is another compartment, okay? Close it back up. Fly little top handle. Grandma's clutch. Okay. This is going to be item number N1. N1 as in Nista. Okay. N1. And this is going to be $30. Now, honey. This, this fall, winter... They're going to be killing the glove game, okay? I'm just going to put y'all on game. They're going to be killing it, okay? I got my gloves. Y'all already know. But this is a long pair of gloves that are sheer, okay? They are sheer. They are net. They are stretch, okay? They have rhinestones going down the side. So if you have an evening event that you'd like to go to, honey, this is going to be that event, okay? Finger has some ruching, okay? And it's two, child. It's two. You need two. You need one for each hand, okay? This is going to be in three, and these are going to be $10, Ten dollars in three. I'm a December baby in same year. We are practically twins. I too had those fibroids and I had it all removed. I'm telling you, I felt better. But when I say I gained 20 pounds in a year, oh my goodness. Are you serious? I know we can get into during story time now got to pay attention to these treasures that's right girl when we have a little intermission honey we gonna we gonna talk about these fibers because they make me sick too child okay now this is a genuine leather belt i don't know if y'all remember the limited when it was around the limited it used to be affiliated with express okay and this is a purple and um, hot pink, like a fuchsia suede. And then the back is black. It has gold accents, okay? Has the gold buckle. I'm going to measure it so I can tell y'all how much it measures. But it is genuine leather. And it is in tip top shape, okay? The measurements for this. How, okay. I received the LV bag and there's nothing authentic about. Um, I didn't get your email, um, Renee. Um, can we talk about this offline, please? I'm in the middle of this, but like I said, I did not get your email. 
I don't check my email until the end of the day. Okay. This belt is 39 inches. Hi, Sarita. But Renee, I will hit you back. Promise you after this live. All right, so this belt is 39 inches long. Wait, actually, 39 and a half inches long, okay? Hot pink, black, and purple, okay? And this is going to be in four. And this is going to be $28. In for $28. Hi, Sarita. You right on time. I'm just really getting started. All right. So now I'm getting ready to move on to the rack. Now, because I just showed those that belt, let me show you these boots. These are purple suede these are vintage okay they also have the gold emblem on the side as well um these are a boot that you slip your foot in and these also do slouch okay they do slouch all right these are a size eight size eight and these are going to be 35 dollars and these are item number N7, N7, size 8. All right, I do have some more belts, okay? And I'm going to show y'all what these belts look like. This one is real pretty. This one, it has that elastic in it. This is what the buckle looks like. Okay. Put this on. Class. All right. That's a, a look right there for you. All right. So it does have some stretch, some give, okay? This belt is N8, N8, and this belt is going to be $18. This next belt is... A suede... And it has the uh, long fringe strings on it, okay? And this one is a, what you call it, a off, the, off the waist type belt. So it can be worn like this. A little loose little tie and put it on your hips. It can be worn like that to be slouchy. Or you can wear it to where it's up. Okay. Yeah. And this is going to be item number N10. And this is $18. N10, $18. Oh. Okay. And the last belt we have is this one right here. This is a genuine leather belt as well, okay? This one is really different. It has a silver grommet, like a lace grommet. Then it has the leather braiding going through. But this is how this one fastens on the inside, okay? Let me not play myself, but I might have to so y'all can see. <laughs> Child. 
I'm about to play myself, child. Hold on. Okay, so what will happen is supposed to go in like this. It will go in, loop around, and fasten. And then you got all this nice detail going around the sides. Oh, child, I like breathing. Okay, so it will go like this. And then you can adjust to fasten, okay? So I'm going to give you the measurements on this belt because, honey, it clearly don't measure me. All right. This is okay. This one is a forty one inches. This is probably best going to fit a size medium. Okay. A medium my waist is a bit thick right now okay no pun intended all right and this is going to be in nine in nine and this is going to be twenty eight dollars hurry up I say The first, well, the third bag we have tonight is this all sequins clutch. Okay, it has the large bow. This bag is sequined from the front to the back to the inside. Okay, it has a zippered part right here, and it also opens at the top like this so that's how deep it go okay but it's a fold down um, clutch and it can be worn in the hand or it can be worn on the shoulder definitely hollering betsy johnson without the betsy price okay this bag is Item, item number 149, and this is going to be $30. One forty nine, thirty dollars. Jamaica, it's what it is. Come in, Jamaica. show this bag on the last live as well this one is has a top handle it is very dainty roughly okay it also has a shoulder strap as well top handle zipper closure inside is red it has this acrylic um Facing going on with it. This is an Angela Fra Fra Frascone. Angela Frascone still has tags attached. This is going to be item number 116, and this is going to be $30 as well. All right, so we have this fancy snatchy bag right here. This is a Carlo Fiore of Italy. Okay, it has the football shape with the print. Okay, and it has a snake print in a blue, a uh, purple, bronze a burgundy red and orange with a little bit of green okay it has the oyster claw claps where it's opened at the inside is a black velvet with an inside pocket okay it has a little star on the back and on the handle, it has this large fringe tassel 
to be worn as such, okay? So it can either be worn as a shoulder bag or you could tuck the straps and make it a clutch, okay? This is item number 261 and this is gonna be $48. I have been binge watching your videos. I'm almost caught up. Love your videos. Always making me laugh. Girl, you done watched all 1,000 of them videos. Okay, I felt like I needed to take a break with the vlogging because, honey, I think I was getting tired of, tired, of, tired of me. Okay. We also have this black football shape as well. Claw, oyster claw, clam claw bag. This one is Fifth Avenue handbags made in the USA. It is uh, wipe, wipeable down on the inside. It does have a zipper pocket. It has a over clasp. This can be worn as a clutch or a shoulder bag. This is item number 393, and this is $45, $393, $45. How many of y'all in this live right now was a part of the last live? all right so we have this off-white cream vintage bag okay it has it's off-white and it has a yellow uh snake print diamond design in the front it's an ostrich print okay ostrich Clean on the inside. This is also genuine leather. This is item number 343. And this one's going to be $40. All right. And here we go. So, Kim and Tina. Okay. This is the last bag, okay? This is genuine leather as well. It does have these very detailed sequent beaded design on it. It's on the front and it's on the back. Pop it open. This is Millie Fiore. This is Carlos Fiore cousin child. Hold on. This bag is item number 108, and this one's going to be $60. This one is just a little bit different, and it is a really nice handbag. It has a leather tassel at the bottom, and then boom, okay? And then slip me a Maggie. All right, let me put these bags up and then we're gonna move on to the clothing. Okay. Hold on, y'all. Let me get some water. Okay, who just came in the room? Who just came in the room? Let me see how many of y'all just came in the room. Whew. All right. <sighs> now, this is going to be kind of a try on live sale tonight because. Some of these items you gotta see them on okay in order to get the full effect so here we go first up 
we have this faux fur, fur, faux, faux fur, however, okay? Look at the detail of the fur, okay? This is so nice, all right? It's lined on the inside all the way through. This is a 22 women's, okay? 22 women's, look. Y'all don't buy, trust me. I, get, I took on a challenge um, last live, okay? Oh, gosh, Bond. <laughs> okay. So here we go. We have that that oversized fur um, vest. It is giving rich auntie vibes, most definitely. Okay, hold on, y'all. My poor dog and jump and ran away. Don't run away, Bon. Don't run away, time. Go to, go back in your bed. Okay. But this is nice. Okay. This is the inside. It is a 22 women's. Okay. This is going to be item number one, 107. And this is going to be $75. This can be layered and worn with so many things. It ain't even funny. Put it on with some all black pants black turtleneck black one piece cat suit um a black dress knit dress a sweater dress this is a great great layering piece this is my favorite time of the year okay this next piece you can do so much with it jeans leg yes so many things okay this one is a new Zara um, little jacket. This is a size medium. It is still new with the tags, still attached. I was told to stop trying this stuff on earlier because I was told it wasn't gonna go nowhere if I kept trying it on. It was gonna be um, stuck with me, okay? So this is, it's like a heather gray, okay? Heather gray, it has like patches of like a little bit of sweatshirt material, but it's like an elevated sweatshirt look, might I add. So you have your jacket, fur, okay? size medium all right so this will fit a medium up to a large and it does zip okay so you can wear it as a, a little top as well if you want it to instead of a jacket however this is item number one zero six and this is a size medium, but it will fit up to a size large. $40.106. Now, let me show y'all something I paired with this. And it looks really good with it. So, I told y'all this is a brand new Zara. And then we have the Zara joggers okay the Zara joggers these are a size large and these are still new with tags as well okay they do have the drawstring in the waist so the waist is adjustable they are knit so they do have some stretch to them they have the tapered cuffed um, Zara leg these are a size large and the bottoms are item number 192 and the bottoms are going to be $22 and the top is 109 and the top is going to be $40. You can have a whole outfit 
$66 from Zara, still with tags attached. You know, you can't walk out the stove in Zara spending $60 on a whole outfit, okay? So, this will go really well together, okay? Next up. <sighs> Child, I was out here putting bond on the corner earlier, okay? This is lined on the inside. This is a red suede fur coat. Okay. Honey. Honey. Okay. Bam. Okay. This is what it looks like up close. Got the cheetah print, the large oversized collar. Please tell me the current Instagram. I'm such a ditz. I can't find the. I only have one girl. Let me show you. That's my current Instagram. Okay. So it does have the metal claps class that will close this up for you. Hold up. Me and nails have not been getting along with her lately. Okay, y'all, it has this class, and here is the hook, okay? I am not going to fight with this, but you get the effect, okay? Nice, nice, and nice some more, okay? This is item number... 23 item number 23 and this coat is going to be $65 hi Danielle okay thank you let me turn that down I'm glad you said you hear it I just be I don't like it to be so silent okay can you still hear it face you I turned it down okay this next piece, I always have vision, y'all. Okay, thank you. I always have vision. This is a blazer, okay? It is a blazer. It has sheer sleeves. It has the satin cuffs, the French cuffs, okay? The satin lapel. These buttons do come up the side. It's like giving a double breast without a double breast. I tried this on and this looks fabulous as like a blazer dress because it can be a blazer dress. It's long enough to where it can be a blazer dress. This is a size 16, size 16. That's vintage, okay? Modern day size, this is going to be a size 12, all right? Size 12. This, it was a little big on me, so I had room, room to spread if I needed to, okay? However, I was like, just to take the, um, the waist in for me, I would just cinch this back part like this. I would just cinch it together and it will give me the waist that I'm looking for. Okay. This looks so good. It has shoulder pads. This is a size 16. This is going to be $40. And this is item number 168. 168. Hi, Gail. Now, also, I told you I'm always putting looks together. I had these pants on the last live and it's a black satin, just like the lapel and the cuffs. 
The pants are a size large, size large. Okay, they do have wide legs. They also do have elastic in the waist with a drawstring. The pants to these are going to be item number 300, and this is going to be $15. You have a whole look for $55. Okay, boom. Now, I showed y'all the pants to this during, I think, the last $10 blowout I did, okay? And y'all were asking me for the jacket, which well, y'all, I would have been looking forever for that damn jacket, okay? Sarita sold number 300, all right? Sarita, you just qualified for one of the giveaways for tonight. So you'll notice your total will be a little different when you get your actual um, invoice tonight, okay? So Sarita. Satin black pants. Yes. Black pants. Ooh, ooh, ooh. All right, this next jacket, baby. I showed y'all the pants. The pants was way too tiny. I don't know who took them pants in, but the pants was way too tiny. But this is what the blazer looked like. So this is the blazer. Okay, it is a plaid. It has the green velvet. It has the cheetah collar with the green velvet trim. We have the green velvet sleeves with the cuffs. Okay, she is by it. Okay, she's by it. Now, this is how this fits. Okay. So boom, it, it was a whole two-piece suit, okay? But the pants were entirely too small. So the pants I no longer have, all right? I don't, they gone. It has these gold statement, like buttons, but they're not buttons, okay? So it's, it's all for the look for me. But this is a great layering piece. Okay, it is lined on the inside. And honestly, this looked like it was like probably custom made. This is going to be item number nine. Item number nine, and this is going to be $58. Item number nine. This is very genuine and one of a kind. This will fit a medium. If you would like it oversized, but it will fit a large up to an extra large. Okay. This is item number nine, $58. All right. We have this gorgeous blouse right here. It is a one shoulder. It has the um, peekaboo shoulder and the flare arm as the sleeve, okay? And then it has a bodice that is like more fitted, but it also has, a, I don't think this is the strap, this is just the piece the, for the hanger, but it would some go something a little bit like this when it was on, okay? Depending on how short you are, this could serve as a dress, but with some nice um, solid slacks or a nice dark denim, this would be lovely, okay? This is a size medium. This is $25, item number 169.
All right, next up, we have this blouse. This is a new with tags Zara blouse as well. It's a little intricate, okay? So we have one sleeve that's long, a cuff, French cuff. It's a faux wrap style, okay? Also, it has like this cami one side shoulder i mean one side top that the uh spaghetti strap is adjustable okay and it is a zip in number okay this is a size large but this did not fit like a large on me okay to me this felt more like a size medium so it would be something like this with the hanging tail in the front, okay? Something that can easily be dressed up with some, this will dress up some denim with the quickness, okay? Hi, Lisa. Item number two. This is gonna be $22, and this is a size large, but fits more like a size medium, and it is a Zara brand. Sarita, so number two. Thank you very much, Sarita. Next up, we have a poet like blouse. This is by New York and Company. It has the ruffled sleeve with the ruffled cuff. It has the um, deep V with the ruffled like neckline. It also has an ascot pussy bow tie. Okay, it's like a secretary top. It is semi sheer, it's flowy. This is a size large. This will easily fit a size medium to large. This is going to be item number 150, and this is going to be $20. Okay, Sarita, number 150. All right, I got you, Sarita. Thank you very much. This next blouse, definitely 90s, funky print, polka dots with all of the colors, the Rainbow Coalition colors, okay, long sleeve. This is by Benenzia. I know y'all remember Benenzia, okay, okay. She's <laughs> that's cute. Long sleeve, has one breast pocket. This is a size medium, wait, size 14, 16, that's going to be like a size large to extra large. This can be belted, okay, and it can be worn in numerous ways, okay? And this is the print all over front and back. This is going to be item number 260, and this is going to be $27. All right, this is a fire ass blazer. Okay, are you ready? Are you ready? You see the print from the back? This is a brocade. Okay, it is like a lime green. Lime green. It has the lapel, the pointy, pointy lapel. It is double breasted. Okay, so this is what happens though when you put it on. It has this split action right here on the side. Okay, so that part gonna be open. It has this pretty detailed embellished button. All right. It also does have, you know, if you modest, 
okay? If you're modest and you don't want to be showing all your, your goods, it has this piece, this middle piece that can also come out as well. It just buttons. So this can be removed. It can be removed, okay? Hey, Ken Ken! 260 measurements, please. Give me one second. This is a size 14. This is a bad ass blazer, okay? I'm living for this. I don't even wanna try this on because if I try this on, I'm gonna go put it off to the side because I was feeling it earlier, okay? This is item number 14. I mean, item number 14. It's a size 14, okay? If you need measurements, let me know. This blazer is going to be $55, item number 14. Item number 260. 260. Hey, Ken Ken. Nice to have you join the party. I need that in a medium. Girl, when I tell you it is bad, it's bad. Okay, it's bad. Okay, so Ken Ken, pit to pit. It's 25 pit to pit. I think you need a 26 or a 27. Sarita. Let me give you the pit to pit on this. Pit to pit on this is a 20. So if you know your pit to pit measurements, and if you are a 20, girl, this will be sharp as I don't know what on you, okay? Sharp. Ooh, honey, sharp. All right, so next up, this is a two-piece suit, okay? It is made out of lace, and it is a metallic silver and brushed gold, okay? Silver and brushed gold, it has this little closure right here on the side. The sleeves are a mesh lace, so the sleeves are see-through, but not the blazer itself. The blazer itself is lined, and it does come with a matching pencil skirt, okay? Now, I'm going to tell you, whoever owned this, they got this um, altered to fit because, baby, this, is, this says a size... 16 us okay size 16 us uh-uh it ain't even happening okay this damn show of ain't no 16 okay and this don't have no stretch okay so i'm gonna give you measurements to this so this is a fly 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 two-piece suit so you know i don't know pit to pit i can just look at it okay so do you want that that blazer that's item number 14 if you want that sarita oh she said not so okay thank you prof um ken ken i have another jacket up here on this rack that's similar to this okay so pit to pit on here because this is not no size 16 child Ain't no way. You're here. Pit to pit. This is 18. Pit to pit. 18 for the blazer. And I'm going to tell you what the, um, the skirt is. The waist I'm telling you somebody altered to fit, okay? 
The waist is a 15 and a half. 15 and a half in the hips. Eighteen. So this was measured. I mean, this was altered to fit. Okay, altered to fit. Which I don't blame them now. I don't, because you can always make something big fit. Okay, this two-piece um, brushed gold and silver suit is going to be sixty-five dollars. And this is item number 16. Item number 16. It's a bad suit too, child. Don't sleep. We have another two-piece. This is a black-on-black -black brocade. To me, it's kind of giving me female tuxedo with a skirt. Okay. That's what it's giving me. This is the black. It is a brocade. It has uh, faux pockets. The pocket has to be split, okay? It has a single button going down the front. It is a satin, like, not a shiny satin, more of like a matte satin. This is the back. Okay, this is by Hugo Biscotti, and this is a size 16, size 16. I'm gonna do the measurement on the pit to pit to give a good reference. Pit to pit is going to be 21. 21 pit to pit on the blazer and on the skirt. The skirt is also also a size 16 as well. Okay. And the skirt is measuring out. The waist, 17, and the hips, 22. All right. This two-piece suit is to be perfect to wear to a holiday party this holiday season. It's a black tie affair, literally. Okay, and to me, I say it's screaming female tuxedo vibes, okay, with a strappy shoe or a pump, baby. Size 16, this is going to be $75, item number 183, 183. Fine, you stay sleep. I sure do. Okay. We have this beautiful sweater. Okay. It has cap sleeves. It has buttons on top of the shoulders. All right. This is a vintage sweater. It has a neutral pink, um, regular green, lime green, black. And as you can see, it has numbers going all across it. Okay. This is the front and this is the back. It is a knit. Okay. And this is best going to fit a small medium. This is going to be $38. And this is item number 31. <laughs> why are you, why are you just hanging in the bed like that, Vaughn? Huh? Next, this is a pearl sweater, okay? So we have the pearls all right here, all around here, and some in the middle, okay? 
it has a cable neckline a mock neckline and it has a cable diamond um, design going through the sleeves to be perfect with something leather or suede add another texture of material to it this is a size extra large this is going to be 35 dollars and this is item number 313. All right, we have this large houndstooth print with all the colors in it, black solid sleeves. We have a mock neck, mock turtleneck. This does have shoulder pads. It has all the colors in it, okay? This will be a sly sweater. You see how it looked with some camo now, right? The camo is the neutral. But you can have your choice of whatever other color bottom that you would want to wear with this, even a solid black. This is a size medium. However, this will fit up to a large. This is going to be $45. And this is item number 44. All right, we have this Carol Little vintage sweater it's kind of giving me coogee vibes coogee vibes without the coogee price tag okay so we have the knit print it has the animal print going down the front panel of the sweater it has an oversized cow neck scarf um collar with fringe tassels going all the way around this is what the back looks like. It's a statement vintage Carol Little sweater. This is a size large, and this is going to be $40. Item number 333. All right, we have this vintage sweater. Okay, it's black and white, and then it has these little detailed little horse buttons on all different colors going down the front. This is a size large. This will fit up to an extra large. These buttons do come loose, so this is an open cardigan, open cardigan. Nice, different type of uh, sweater. This is going to be item number 299, and this is going to be $45. Next up, we have some embellished sweaters. This is vintage. It has the beaded tassels hanging off the front. It is a scoop neck. However, there is a flaw on this. It does have a small little hole here. However, y'all, y'all know everything is being rocked as if it was distressed. So hello and hello to Mo. So the price is going to definitely reflect this flaw. This is going to be $30. And this is a size large. Size large, $161. She's still got some wear somewhere going on in her okay she still got it wait till y'all see this distressed sweater i bought myself child i bought a sweater with a bunch of holes in it you hear me we have this free people hot pink textured sweater it is going to fit fit it so it's gonna fit like a baby tee but it is stretchy and it's knit okay this is by free people and this is hold on this 
this is a size medium however this will fit down to a size small as well okay and it's textured all the way around i think this will look so fly with some leather okay some leather bottoms whether it's shorts a skirt or some pants item number 281 this is going to be 22 dollars All right, we have another vintage embellished sweater. This one has rhinestones, embroidery, some beading and pearls on it, okay? It is a hot pink color, dolman sleeves. So this is, I love sweaters that are like dolman sleeves, okay? They love it. This is a size... The tag says a size small, but this will fit up to a size large. And because it has this, for, this is forgiving right here, that is why. It does have shoulder pads, small ones, that can be removed, okay? This one does not have any flaws. And this one's going to be $48. And this is item number 182. Fun. What are you doing? All right, so we have this sweater tunic. So this can be a sweater dress on a short girl, okay? Short woman. This could be a sweater dress. However, it could be a sweater tunic as well. It has this embellished design in it of turquoise, orange, like a coral. And then it has silver beading going throughout it has an oversized uh collared neckline this is a size small however it does have some stretch this will fit up to a medium and this is going to be 43 dollars and this is going to be item number 223 hello all right so, a play on the military, okay? Child found us in the men's department because you always got to go scope out the men's department, okay? This is, I don't know the brand. Um, it says commercial textiles. However, it does say freedom on the front with a large patch with a dove, some fire, okay? And a big heart. It also has some type of rank ribbon right here, okay? The back is solid green. I like a good v-neck sweater. i do. Seth, can you hold 223 up to you? What is 223? Let me see. One second, Sarita. So this is a v-neck this is a size medium to large medium to large i don't know about y'all but i can wear my sweaters oversized depending on my bottom or that my sweater can be fitted depending on my bottom and how i'm gonna wear it this is going to be 30 dollars, and this is item number 178 two two three So here we go, two, two, three. There's the neck, some, some tights. Okay, some tights, or you could do a slip dress up under it to give you just that little extra comfort if you wearing it to the workplace. But a short girl, I'm five one. This will easily be a sweater dress on me. Next up, this sweater right here honey it's the black and white and the fuzziness for me with the rainbow on the sleeves and on the bottom this is by torrid and this is a size three i'm assuming that's a 3x this is going to be 40 dollars. item number 217 leather shorts you're thinking like me girl all right sarita so 223 
All right, Sarita, I got you. Thank you very much, ma'am. This next sweater, this is Mark Carducci. This is a size large. It is a marled sweater. So it has lots of marled yarn. It also is a dolman sleeve sweater. Um, it has a red cobalt blue, black, a teal green, and it has this design in it. And then it has this, um, this knitted design in it as if it was trying to be some type of butterfly. Okay. This is the back. This is a size large. However, this will fit a medium as well. It has shoulder pads that can be removed. And this is item number 110. And this is $45. Okay. We have another Dolman sweater. This one has a bit more embellishments with some 3D effects of art on it okay it's got the hot pink this one has some uh, beading everything is sewn okay so i want you to see that everything is sewn small shoulder pads it does have a keyhole neck um neck closure in the back Dolman sleeves is black Okay, beautiful, beautiful design. Okay, this is a size small, <coughs> but this is going to fit up to a size large, up to a size large, and this is going to be $58, and this is item number 204. Now this next piece... <laughs> If I was a teacher in school, child, I would tear this up, okay? I would tear it up, okay? This is a handmade sweater, okay? Handmade. It's a cardigan. And look at the details to this cardigan. We got pop. Look at this. Hot dogs. Okay, the unicorns, like we are literally like at a carnival, okay? It's got the pockets, it buttons down front. Over here, what is this? Balloons. It is a rich cobalt blue. This is the back. Okay, this is gorgeous. Like gorgeous. Okay gorgeous and this is handmade this is handmade okay it got a label somebody sewed a label on it but this is handmade all right hey Allie this is a size um medium but it will fit up to a size large okay will fit up to a size large I would definitely pull the pink, pull the pink, and I will pull probably this blue out with whatever um, bottom I wore with it. But this is definitely a statement sweater, and this is going to be a conversation starter. Okay. This is going to be $78 because it is very one of a kind, different. And this is going to be item number 153. Now, before I show y'all this next piece, I got to show y'all these shoes first, okay? Let me tell you. These are some cowboy boots, okay? Some cowboy boots, and they are fire, okay? 
these are a size eight they have this um this embellishment they are a tan in red leather okay they do have the side zipper and they're plaid on the inside okay the heels are still good on these and it is leather uppers all right size eight all right bam the only thing is just one piece of embellishment fell out of this one but to me the flaws is what makes it for me okay i like these now these are only for purchase if somebody is interested in them okay because if not they can stay with me <laughs> but i wanted to show y'all those boots first because look at this cardigan okay we have the yarn detail the stitching okay it's got the horses and all this you know it's giving like indian like vibes okay it is zippered and it is all the way around front and back it is a lightweight cotton and this is by chico's it's 100 percent cotton and embroidery okay this is a size two so this is gonna fit more like a size large extra large this does have stretch in it okay so it can be worn oversized this is going to be thirty dollars and this is item number two five one next up we have this fabulous blazer this blazer already resides in my closet so when i found another one the other day i just had to pick it up for one of y'all okay so look at it closely it is a blazer that has men's shirts with ties okay men's shirts with ties this is definitely a one-of-a-kind piece. It has front pockets. It does have a single button closure. The background is black. It's a black background. And the print goes all the way around. This is best going to fit a medium to large. Medium to large. It does have shoulder pads to give it shape. And this is going to be $40. And this is item number 30. Item number 30. So this concludes the new items for this week. I'm going to show y'all some shoes. We have, oh gosh, my back. We have these sneakers right here okay they are a purple pink with some green black and white with the pink um shoelaces i ordered the wrong size so my my mistake yo win these are going to be twenty dollars twenty dollars and these are a size seven size seven twenty dollars um you can just claim them by saying um a runner sold runner next i have a pair of vans these are a size These are scotch guarded and these are a U.S. women's size five and they are suede. They are suede and they are a nice neutral color sneaker. Okay. And these are going to be $25, $25, 
size women's five and you can just put down van sold vans sold vans so so runners okay All right, so Sarita is who I see first, and then Tina, I see you as the runner-up. Okay, so these are size five women's, and these are going to be $25, and these are just, you can claim these by saying sold vans. Okay, so I know y'all seen the dunks that's called the pandas, okay? Before I got a pair of the dunks, child, these did the job just fine. Do you hear me? Okay, don't nobody know, and you better be staring at my shoe long enough, okay? These are from Primark, and y'all know Primark dupes everybody, okay? Everybody. Any designer, shoe, heel, they dupe. So this is the black and white knockoff version of the um, Panda Dunks, okay? Simple black and white shoe, okay? They are clean. I only wore them, I think, twice, okay? And then I got... I got the real thing. Okay. Um, these are from Primark. Brand new. Only worn twice. And these are a size 7. And these are going to be N6. N6. Size 7. And these are going to be $30. Okay. N6. It is the year of the blazers. They are everywhere, but I do think you have the market beat on the best collections. Girl, let's not even talk about the market, Mary, because I'm going to tell you, it is hot out here for a pimp right now. Do you hear me when you out here thrifting? The thrift stores are not what they used to be. And that's on everything. They are not what they used to be. If you was following me yesterday, girl, while I was out thrifting, I was complaining. Okay, I was straight up complaining about the store. Okay. Complaining. Because it is it is hard out here, honey. Okay, so y'all know I love my Doc Martins. I wear them with everything. Okay. Everything. Now I'm gonna tell y'all, I'm not a fan of the original Doc Martens because the original ones, you had to unlace them things, child. It was no zipper access to just put your foot in your shoe and go on about your business. No, I do not like the old school um, Doc Martens. I need zipper access, child. So, <laughs> I had got these from some for somebody and they changed their mind. Okay. However, these are a knockoff of the Doc Martin Jadens. Okay. And I'm gonna show you what I'm talking about. I'm gonna take my shoe off, child. The telltale thing with the Doc Martin is literally the yellow stitching. Okay. The yellow stitching and this part right here. The tab so it's the yellow stitching this is the the real one okay doc martin it is a platform combat boot and this is the number one reason why i wanted to tell because it has the zipper access it's a thick sole it gives me height and they are very very comfortable okay so this is the real thing this is 200 dollars right here versus these okay it is a uh, a platform heel as well thick sole it has the lacing going up has the tab in the back 
And this is that main feature, child. It's got to have a zipper. Okay, it's got to have a zipper. These are a size 7. These are a size 7. And these are going to be CB1. CB1. And these are going to be $39. These have not even been worn. Okay? So these are going to be CB1. CB1. Combat Boot 1. Size 7. It is a dupe of the Doc Martin. Only difference is it has black stitching and not yellow. And it does not have the signature tab. However, child, I will roll them. You heard me? I will roll them. Okay. I'm going to put my, my shoe back on before I feel unbalanced around here. Okay. Y'all be sure to hit the like button. Okay. Hit the like button. So these are CB1 and these are going to be 39 and they're brand new. All right. Next, I have these Coach Snow Boots. They are the Coach Signatures. Okay. Uh, they have the zip down front. Okay. We'll leave your tab sticking out if you'd like. They are patent leather going around the sides and the back. They are a gold, black, cream, gray, silver um, print. Does have the coach tab on it. The bottom. Okay. And these are a size eight, size eight. And these are going to be a hundred dollars, hundred dollars, size eight. Okay. So let's have a little five minute break right quick. Ken, Ken, you still out? Could you put five minutes on the clock, girl? <clears throat> Let me see. Let me put five minutes on the clock. Okay. So, y'all, this is my news I got to tell y'all, child. Intermission, and then I'll do the other half of the rack. Y'all. I got scheduled for my procedure. I'm scheduled for my procedure on November 30th. Okay? November 30th. I have been battling with these freaking fibroids, child, for the past two years, really. But the last year, I've been really fighting with them, honey. Fighting. So, I finally got my date. Um... Was it yesterday? Was it yesterday? Yes, I got my date yesterday. Um, so they was trying to do it the week of Thanksgiving. I said, child, please. I said, um, <coughs> I'm trying to have fun for the holidays, child. Y'all ain't going to have me um, on bed rest and on lockdown, child, for, for the, um, the Thanksgiving. No, ma'am. So, I'm excited that they I finally scheduled this again, and I'm doing a different procedure this go-round. Totally different one. She said, I will know if and when I get mine removed, when I go back to my OBGYN. Yes. So, the day you go back, the day before, is before I get my, um, my procedure, girl. I'm having a UFE done. A UFE, and that's when they go in through your growing, and they go through the artery, and they cut the blood supply off to the fibroids. So if there's no blood supply, they can't be hungry, they can't be um, sucking blood from your uterus and all of that. So if there's no blood supply, 
they shrink and die. Okay. And my new gynecologist thought that this would be the best approach for me because um, I will be approaching 50 next year. I'm proud to say that too. I'm proud to say it. I'll be approaching 50 and I don't know when I'm going to start menopause. But um, he just told me that this definitely should take me through to menopause. Therefore, I can keep all of my girly parts and all of my organs and all that stuff. Because it took me a long time to want to get a hysterectomy. And then when all that stuff happened where my stuff got canceled and all of that, I said, child, that was a sign. That wasn't nothing but the Lord. Okay. The new OBGYN said that this would be better for me just because I'm at high risk for um, DVTs because I had one last year. So if they be trying to tell y'all to take um, birth control pills for shrinking fibroids, I'm going to go ahead and tell you estrogen feeds them, Okay. So it's a hard no for me. Neither one of my daughters want to be on birth control now after what happened to me last year from taking birth controls to try to control the flow so that the, the fibroids would shrink. I wasn't on them for two weeks and then that was it. Thank you, honey. Keep me in your prayers. But I'm going to be all right. God already told me, child. He confirmed it. I was so happy to get that phone call yesterday. But I have to see y'all after Thanksgiving, child. Y'all ain't gonna have a sister down. So what y'all think I'm about to be doing before um, November 30th? I'm about to get my house prepped for Christmas. So I'm gonna start putting my tree up, start decorating, because I'm gonna be looking at it. Cause I ain't gonna, if I wait, child, it won't be no Christmas at the longs, okay? And that don't happen, honey. I like the, I like the um the ambiance of the holiday season, okay? So I ain't gonna let nothing keep me down, honey. No, ma'am. I sure am not. So that was my news I wanted to share with y'all. And I have one more announcement at the end. Okay. Hello, Joseph. What does RR mean? I don't know what that means. What that mean? Birth control. It can be good. However, it can also um, not be a good a good thing. Okay. Bond. There, there he go, child. You see him? Bond. <laughs> Come here, honey. Come here. Come say hi to the ladies. Come hello to the ladies come on come on you be doing the mouth i have several fibroids but i don't have a period anymore um therefore they are not going they're not i guess growing no problems over here thank lord listen once i found out i had them I had to figure out what the hell was going on because I'm not the only one that has them. Um, all my sisters, all of us have them. Yet I had to go tell my mama, y'all, to go get checked out and go see if she has fibroids. <sighs> Lo and behold, she has fibroids too. So I'm thinking it is something that can be hereditary because every single one of me and my sisters, we all have them. Okay. And Two of them, two of them so far have done different procedures um, to take care of theirs. Um, and my mom, they told her since she didn't already went through menopause and she said they never bothered her. She said they said that it wouldn't be wise for her to get hers removed right now unless she wanted to for vanity purposes because they do take up space in your abdomen okay they do they just hanging out in there all right just a fibroid is a tumor it's a non-cancerous tumor yeah it is a tumor i don't like that word okay i do not 
It's like Bond is our dog too. He's he is part of the family. Child, that's the niece. That is the niece the mascot. <laughs> that is the niece the mascot, honey. I don't know who this is, but uh, not today, Greg. Okay. Keisha said, mine doesn't bother me. But you have, that's enough to bother anybody, child. Heavy period. Okay. I'm sorry, honey. Come here. Then they want to say hi to you. Come, come. He makes me so sick. Okay. So sick. Well, Kim, good thing yours is not bothering you and you don't have a period anymore, so you are good, okay? That sounds like a great option. You still get to keep the rest of your parts and with all your other health issues, it's good to keep everything intact for the hormones. Yes, and that was one thing that he was telling me. The only other issue I have is really my RA. And I haven't been on any medication for my RA, y'all, since October 3rd. And actually, I've been I've been doing pretty good not being on anything right now. Because they are waiting until I have this procedure before I can start a new medication that they want me um, on for my RA. So I had a flare the other day, though, and it damn near took me out, child. But it didn't last long. Thank God. It did not last long. Oh, see, he done came over here. Come on. He trying to rest. He ain't trying to rest. He rests all day. Okay. Say hi. Say hi, ladies. Hi. It's my baby. <laughs> He's so serious. He's so serious. Serious, y'all. Bond is gonna take his first flight. Yes, he's going. He's going to Thanksgiving too. Nobody's leaving me in no pet resort. Oh hell no. He do not like the pet resort, y'all. He don't. So I'm gonna take a chance, and he gonna fly with us. Okay. I, I can't. I can't touch your paw. I got him his um. Airport approved doggy bag, so he gonna get pulled and he gonna be bougie bond, child. He gonna be bougie bond all up in the airport. Yeah, Mama, I want lipstick on my face. You put lipstick on my face. Okay, go get back in your bed. Oh, and the recovery will be so much. <laughs> now I heard that the recovery for UFE is painful the first four to five days. But that's why I asked, I requested to stay overnight, honey. Y'all gonna help manage this pain, okay? Y'all ain't gonna send me home as an outpatient and me over here be suffering. Oh, no. Not I. Oh, yes, honey. I gotta take care of me. I do. But I'm gonna end this year with all ducks in a row and everything scratched off the list. You hear me? Our egg gonna be under control, and these fibroids is gonna finally get handled. Bam! That is what I'm talking about. Bam! So I'm gonna run through what we had from last week or the week before, and I'm gonna start with the blazers. We have this military style blazer that has the the ribbons. It's simple. It's all black. It is a piece. It is double-breasted. It's lined. And this is going to best fit an extra large. And this is going to be $65. And this is item number 186. We have this fancy schmancy blazer right here. It is a cobalt blue and black pinstripe. It has a single button closure. It is nice and tailored to fit. It has pockets. It is by Tahari. And this is a size 12. This is going to be $45. And this is item number 142.
okay something like i'm wearing right now mine is a patchwork this one is a tapestry patchwork and this one has the tapestry on it is definitely similar to what i am wearing let me show y'all this is a size 2x that i'm putting on size 2x okay let y'all see how this fits okay 2x it has these uh decorative wooden buttons going down the um side all right this is the back and it is a tapestry print all right and hold on no pockets okay so it is just like perfect as a layering piece this is a size 2x it's lined on the inside as well hello mother how are you this is a size 2x this is going to be $60, and this is going to be item number 74. We also have this uh, patchwork tapestry jacket as well. This is a size extra large. This is lined. as well now i want y'all to see how how to how to um the the camo just be working with everything so that's definitely a mix on print okay mix on print so this is a size extra large this one is a hundred percent silk Okay, 100% silk. And this is going to be $65. You see the, the man holding the holding the stick with he carrying something. It's a story, honey. $65. Item number 21. We have this cocoon duster. It is in a purple and black. It can be um, worn reversible if you like. You just have to cut the tag out of it. I'm going to show y'all how this fits. It is one size. Fits. Okay. One size fits. All right. So this is the length on it. This is it to be open, to be worn open. And as you can see, it has the cocoon dome and sleeves. Difference with dome and cocoon is the cocoon opens up. So there's, there's room to be up in here. Okay. So this one is going to be $35, $35. And this is item number 279, 279. $279, $35, one size. This next piece, this is really fly. This is a size 14. This is vintage. It's dead stock. Okay, still has the original tags on it. It has this embroidered embroidery on the sheer sleeves. Okay, it's single button. This could be worn with like some leather or pleather like leggings. Okay, 
but it's gonna fit like a um a peplum kind of it's gonna cinch the waist in and then it's gonna flare like a skirt it has shoulder pads it is a candy apple green size 14 this is gonna be 45 dollars item number 291 This is a men's blazer, okay? I tell y'all, the men's department has the best blazers because they be long, child. They be long and they be just what you be needing, okay? So look at that whole look with the slip dress on, okay? So if I was going to the office, I would possibly have on some pumps with this or some booties or the shoes I'm wearing, honey, I sure would, because I would be that chick, okay? So this is like a hound's tooth in brown, gold, and a gray. It has the buttons to where it does button. This is best gonna fit a size large, and this will close on me. It is lined and all. And this men's blazer is going to be $50. $50. It does have the inside coat pockets as well. And this is going to be item number three. We have this blazer, like crop blazer top. It's a funky print. This is 100% rayon. Yes. Funky print. It has these uh, embellished buttons going down the middle. It has a mix on mix on print type vibes that is the front and this is the back this is going to be 30 dollars. this is size 14 and this is going to be item number 98. we have this fabulous fabulous blazer right here okay this is a pearl cream color okay it's also on brocade it has the pearl buttons going down the middle. It has the beaded and embroidered embellishment going across the breast, shoulder pads. It fits really good. Now, this is a vintage size 18. So this will definitely fit a modern day size 14 slash 12. Okay. Very beautiful piece. <sighs> Great with some denim. This is going to be $55, item number 135. This next is a play on a sweater and denim. The front paneling is denim, pockets are denim, but the rest is cable knit sweater, okay? Nice play on denim and a sweater the back of course is denim this is a size medium yet this will fit all the way up to a size extra large okay this is nice this is going to be seventy dollars seventy dollars and this is item number 18. We have this sweater dress, vintage, dolman sleeves as well, in a turquoise and black. This is where it stops at on me. Okay, so this one is a little longer knee length, but it is a sweater dress. This is the back, and this is the front. This is a one size, and this is $50, and this is item number 165. 
we have this oversized sweater vest. It has marled yarn, so it's marled crochet, okay? It has the feathers on the sleeves. It has a tassel string closure, if that's how you wanted to wear it. Now I, I would just wear it open, okay? And just let the tassels hang. This would be like a nice layering piece. This is one size as well. And this is going to be $48. And this is item number 176. We have this embellished sweater as well. This one still is a dead stock. It still has the original tags. This one is sequins in hot pink. Oh, I am loving all this detail. Okay. Dome and sleeve as well. This is a size small, but will fit up to a size medium. This is going to be $68. Item number 220. We have this anthropology sweater coat in this purple sea foam green lavender shades of blue it has the blanket fringe going around the collar all the way down to the hem it is belted this is a size small but it will fit up to a medium okay it's a sweater coat this is going to be $65 as well item number seven We have this fly textured yellow, pastel yellow sweater. It's like shaggy, fringy, the sleeves, the collar, everything. Nice play on texture. Okay, see that texture up against the slip dress? This is going to be $40. This is a size medium. And this is item number 97. All right, we have this fun, cozy, comfy sweater. It has buttons going down both sides, so it gives off the effect of double-breasted. It's fuzzy, soft, cozy, perfect with denim or some leggings. This is a size large, and this is going to be $40, item number 164. also have this vest this is a crochet knitted vest it has black trim perfect for layering has splits on the side as well this is a one size as well this is going to be 25 dollars item number 36 This skirt set by BB, the tags say a size large. This is best going to fit a size medium, okay? This is the cropped moto jacket, and this is a suede, and it is by BB. I know y'all remember me from back in the day. And this is the mini skirt to go with it. It has a zipper to open up a split and to close up as well. This is $60 for the set. The tag says a large, but it will best fit a medium, okay? Item number 72. What's up, honey? It's almost time to go. We have this two-piece Waverly set. It is in like a teal blue. This is the blouse. It is a size medium. And then these are the pants. 
And these are size medium as well. The set is going to be $29. And this is a size medium. Item number 38. We have this white cream two-piece. This is the details for me. 100% rayon. It has the macrame mesh lace that hangs. It also has the lace embroidery. I mean, a lace inlay around the neckline. Collar, shoulder pads, decorative buttons. The bottoms are straight legs with elastic in the waist. This is a size eight slash 10. So this is gonna be $35, item number 262. And y'all, that's pretty much all I got for tonight. So if it's anything else that you were interested in seeing, such as before we get off, let me know. And I will gladly pick it up for you. Okay. Okay. All right. So if you see anything that you want, even by catching the replay or by if you stopped and paused because you want to go do something, take a shower with y'all, I understand. Okay, I do. Catch the replay. You can hit me up on Instagram at I am Eclectnista. Send me a item number or a screenshot of the items that you're interested in, and I will definitely give you a um, an invoice with your total and all of that good stuff. Okay. So if y'all don't have nothing else tonight, I'm going to go. I'm going to be peace out like a mug. You hear me? Peace out. Whew. Can I see item number 74 again? What was 74, um, Dee Dee? If you could just give me a reference, I don't have to look at the old rack. I'm oh, sorry, Bond. Number 74. Here we go. The tapestry. Jacquard. <clears throat> Blazer top. Okay, yes. This is it. And then this is the back. This was a 2X and this was $60. So let me know, Miss Didi. Oh. All right, y'all. I am good on time. It is ten twenty-two, and I'm about to go um, de glam, and I'm about to go watch Sisters. That's what I'm about to go watch on BET Plus. I sure am. Okay, <clears throat> so. See anything you like?
just let me know. Miss Rita, I will be sending you an invoice over. Thank you, ladies, for showing up for me tonight. I appreciate it. And um, I look forward to seeing you in the next live. I'll see y'all again probably on Tuesday for a thrift haul. All right. So I'll talk to y'all later. And y'all have a blessed evening. Good night. <laughs>